welcome to the Monster Emotion series with me, Emma. Before we meet today's monster, let's warm up together. Nola is going to help us warm up today. Hello, Nola. Roll your shoulders backwards. Put your hands on your shoulders and roll your elbows backwards. And now the arms. Change direction and roll the arms forwards. The elbows. And now the shoulders. And shake out your body. Squeeze your shoulders upwards and relax. Squeeze and relax. Squeeze and relax. And shake your body out once more. Spread your legs and bend your knees down and up. Down and up. Bring your feet together and reach up to the sky and touch the floor. Up to the sky and touch the floor. March on the spot. And now run. And freeze. Run as fast as you can. And freeze. Run, run, run. and freeze. Put your hands on your hips and make nice big circles. And the other direction. Swing your arms back and forth. Shake out your feet. Excellent. Are you all warmed up now? Which monster do you think we are going to meet today? It's our scared monster. Can you make a scared face? How do you stand when you feel scared? Can you show me? How do you walk when you feel scared? The scared monster sometimes walks slowly, looking around, covering its eyes to show how it feels. Can you walk around the room like the scared monster? Slowly, looking around, covering your eyes. Well done. The scared monster wants to know, what makes you feel scared? Today, we are going to help our scared monster feel safe and calm. First, let's play a game. I'm going to name a colour 
and I want you to find something of that colour around your house. Are you ready? Let's start with the colour green. Off you go. Did you find something? Next, let's try the colour white. Excellent. Last colour now. Let's choose blue. Now I want you to go and find a soft toy that you think will help the scared monster to feel safe and calm. And when you come back, we'll do our stretches together. This is how to stretch your body to help calm your scared monster. Stand tall and strong, breathe in and out. In and out. Step your right foot back. Bend your left knee and reach your arms up. Breathe here for a few seconds. Move the right foot back further and turn your body to face the side. The arms should be in a straight line, the right arm stretching backwards and the left arm stretching towards the front. Bring your hands to the floor and step the left foot back. Bend your knees gently and by pushing your hands into the floor, push your bum upwards with your knees staying bent. Breathe here. Lift the right leg in the air and step forward. Reach your arms up and repeat on this side. Move the left foot back further and turn your body to face the other side. The arms should be in a straight line with the left arm stretching backwards now and the right arm stretching towards the front. Bring your hands to the floor and step the right foot back. Bend your knees gently and by pushing your hands into the floor, push your bum upwards with your knees staying bent. Breathe here. Bring your knees to the floor. Push your bum back onto your feet. Rest and breathe here. Your arms can be straight out in front of you. Or bring your hands to rest under your forehead. Or let them relax at your side whatever is comfortable for you. When you are ready, you can slowly move to sit up. Well done. Now we are going to use our hands and fingers to massage. Nola is going to help me show you how massage can help to calm our monsters. Would you like me to draw shapes on your back today, Nola? We always ask permission before we touch someone else's body. 
Nola has answered with yes please. If you don't want anyone touching your body right now, that is okay and that is your choice. Maybe you would like to massage your soft toy instead. If you would like a massage today, maybe you can use your hands to draw a picture of your monster on your partner's back or on your cuddly toy. shapes can you draw on your partner's back? When you are finished, you can rest your hands on your partner's back. Now you can swap over. Remember to ask permission first. Would you like me to draw shapes on your back today? finished you can rest your hands on your partner's back. Well done. Slowing down our breathing can help calm our monster. Let's practice together now. Today we are going to use the shape of our hands to help us control our breathing. Raise one hand and use a finger from the other hand to trace the shape of the hand we are holding up. As we move up a finger, we breathe in. As we move down a finger, we breathe out. Breathe in and out. Breathe in and out. Breathe in and out. We can try the other hand now, breathe in 
and out. In and out. Breathe in and out. In and out. In and out. Bring your hands to rest on your legs. Take one more deep breath in and out. Well done. You should already have a soft, cuddly toy that makes you feel better when you're scared. If you don't, maybe you could use a pillow or a soft blanket instead. So, cuddle your teddy and choose a superpower to help you take care of your scared monster. Which would you like to choose today? Being strong, brave or calm? Cuddle your teddy and repeat your superpower after me. I am strong. I am brave. I am calm. Let's try that again. I am strong. I am brave. I am calm. Well done. Find somewhere comfortable to lie with your soft toy and listen to our story. Close your eyes, be very still, and imagine that you are holding a big balloon. It is very light. How does it feel to touch? What colour is the balloon? This balloon is so light, it starts to float up into the air. Hold on tight and feel the balloon gently rising into the sky. You know that you are in control and can return safely to Earth whenever you choose. The big balloon is pulling you further and further into the air. Take a deep breath in and then breathe out slowly. Breathe in deeply again and breathe out slowly. Each time you breathe in and out, you gently glide further and further into the warm summer sky. The deeper your breath is, the further you can travel. See how far you can drift through the air holding on to your balloon. Keep breathing deeply and floating through the sky. Take in a deep breath to the count of four and breathe out slowly to the count of six. Breathe in for four, one, two, three, four, and breathe out for six, one, two, three, four, five, six, Breathe in for four, one, two, three, four, and breathe out for six, one, two, three, four, five, six. You are now high up in the sky. Enjoy this feeling of weightlessness. Enjoy the feeling of being completely free. Your body feels weightless and free and your mind feels totally free. Your legs and arms are floppy and relaxed. Stay here 
breathing deeply for as long as you wish. Breathe in deeply and breathe out and let go. Breathe in, breathe out. And now when you are ready, wiggle your fingers and toes, have a big stretch and open your eyes. I am light, I am light. How do you think the monster feels now? Is it calm? Is it relaxed? How do you feel? Thank you for joining me today and I'll see you soon.